The thing with uh, James, though, is he's a student of Migo. I started in Justice, taught him Aquaman. Okay. Became one of the best Aquaman players in the country. And Where's Tom Brady? Now, Mortal Kombat. <laughs> the other interesting about, thing about James is his main background is Marvel vs. Capcom 2. Marvel 2 actually very strong here in the Philippines. You guys may have heard of this tournament, okay? There was a very famous tournament where they flew clockwork here to play. And uh, lots of people have watched the videos online. But pretty interesting. Uh, here, they play on damage setting 1, I yeah, think. Yeah, level 1 damage. <laughs> so which it's, changes. It's a totally different game. Imagine trying to play Strider Doom in damage 1, where you just do no chip and it takes forever to kill them. is totally no. different. What they say is... The, the player whose team does well in that setting is Mike Ross's team. Oh, really? Looks like they're going to start, fellas. So we got... Uh, Migo's picking Ermac. Yep. Mystic Ermac. Cassie Cage. Oh, button check. Oh, it's a button check. check. All right. Yeah, Cassie but these Cage. are their mains. All right. I happen to know a lot about Cassie Cage. She was... Uh, I dual mained her and Sonya Blade in this game. And she hasn't changed too much between versions. A couple of very minor nerds, but mostly the same character. He's playing Hollywood version. There are a lot of local players who say that Hollywood, uh, Cassie Cage is overpowered. I think here. that she's dumb good. I mean, I played her for a reason. I think she's great. Anyway, Mystic Ermac versus Hollywood Cassie. All right. And Vigo has got a nice start. Great ground pound. Another pound. Yeah, that's me. That's me. He's going to play carefully. Looks like we don't have the lowered health bars, unfortunately. No. Oh, we, we can. I know, we, we, no, we can't see the the other bar. Yep. I keep getting what it's called. I bet if you cheat and use a Street Fighter overlay, that it'll work just fine. Okay. That string, the second hit, yeah, is an overlay. It. It's really annoying. And uh, great, great long range pressure. This is actually how I feel Ermac should play this type yeah. of matchup. Cassie Cage, although she does have some good long range buttons, she really wants to get close to do her great damage. A uh, 2 4 2 string. Yeah. Okay, nice break. That was smart. Anyway, if he can keep Cassie out of the game, uh, he'll be in there. 2 4 2, the second hit of that string is low. So he should try to be aware of that. Okay, nut punch, lots of plus frames. Oh, nice. Low setup. Okay, EX. More pressure. Another 2 4 2. This time he blocks it. Nice. Okay, good break. Promo Kid trying to steal the round. Nice gunshot. Yeah. And a low will close it out. Nice down four. Alright. Eagle's gonna try the, the, the distance game again, but I think. James yeah, the thing is, he's trying to get in with back one, which is a good idea because it's a great long range poke. But actually, uh, Migo San has been very good about spacing it so that back one won't reach. Well, well he, he's the master. He, he taught James, so he knows oh, what James wants okay, to do. I see. He knows what he wants to do. It seems like that. It seems that he can tell when James wants to move forward. That's Promo Kid. His real name is James. Yes. He went for the overhead. Oh, Got nice. poked on. That is the game. Game number one is going to go to Migo San. Very frustrating type of matchup for Cassie, yeah. but again, Cassie can definitely win this matchup. Once she is close, okay, Ermac is sad. Yeah, we saw that in, so the, sec we saw that in the second yeah. round. James did get in. Oh! Okay, Sub-Zero change. That's interesting. This was one of James's first characters. Okay. He started out playing Kitana in Sub-Zero. Oh, wait. All right. Oh, sh <laughs> He's bringing out... Long range versus long yeah. range. Did he pick this Bone Shaper? No, Bone Shaper has yeah. the funny hands, right? Usually. Let's see what version I, I, he picked. I missed, what he, I missed what he picked. It's okay. We'll find out in game. One nice thing this they is tell what, you in yeah, the game, But this is, is so the character he used to go far in the first Manila Cup last year. Oh, oh, that bone, bone Shaper. Okay. Of course, that's, it, that's James' favorite. And James is actually a very strong proponent of zoning in any game he plays. Zoner on Zoner matchup. It gets in. Okay. Spends the oh. EX. Nice break. Oh. I love the big change they made to breakers. It used to be that when you broke, you lost yeah. your stamina, but the opponent kept theirs. Now uh, it takes away both players' stamina, which that I feel is a lot more fair. It, it really resets the situation. Oh, missed on the follow-up there. Still got a good lead. And nope. Nope, not enough for the chip out. Oh, uh oh, this is big. That's this is it. big. He gets a setup after this too. Combo. Setup. Here it comes. Got him. That's so That's tricky. It. 
second hit of that string is overhead, but he timed us at the first hit whip. They made it very difficult to block correctly. At the same time, I think James is doing better this round. Well, this match, it's been closer than the first one. In the first one, it was like, me go all the way round one, James kind of adapts, gets round, gets round two, and round three, it's me go again. Hooked with the last oh, hit. Oh, nice. EX got Using the armor. armor on it. Good blocks. Caught him again. Every time that he's gone yeah. for the dash in, Miko San has been ready. Nice grab. Punish nice. opportunity. He gets it. That's going to be the game. All right. Two to zero. Miko San with the down two finish. And James go back, goes back to player select. <laughs> Look at the crowd. Ooh, they're all hype. <laughs> that dude's out cold. Resident Sleeper on the. Yo! <laughs> That was literally the resident sleeper face. That's godlike. You guys saw that. Yeah. On Oil King, no less. Oh, that's oil. <laughs> I'm done. I'm so done. I know that the yeah, chat well, must be loving that right now. Yeah. Thank. Shouts to Red Bull for the for these. For the, these bean, the bags. bean bags. They're super nice. Did you see someone take a freaking dive and like fall oh. over? Oh, that was. <laughs> The best. That was the best. I want to see the champion do that. He literally did a baseball slide right over all the bean bags. <laughs> all right, game number three coming up, fellas. Back to, Back Cassie, to Cassie Cage. Cage. He's still in Hollywood variation. That means it's time for some nut punches. It, nice. nice down for three. Nut punch for the plus range. Nice grab. Let's go to the corner. Cassie Cage all about touching those nuts. <laughs> Seriously, everything is a nut punch in this variation at least, Actually, right? Actually, yeah. Nice EX, that was very smart. That move actually oh, not nice. invincible, but it's very quick. Again. The ding-dongs. Mix-up, nice six. Uh, forward one K, more mix-up. Forward three, sorry. I haven't played Mortal Kombat in a while. <laughs> Setups. Let's see what we got. Okay, he pushed him out. EX oh. gunshot, very smart. Actually, if he had ducked instead of blocked, yeah. then he wouldn't have found a chip there, but it's a guessing game. Traded. Okay, nice down four. Great pressure off the back one. Nice back dash, using the invincibility. That was very cool. Good block. Nice throw. Wake up EX. Yeah. He's been using the delay wake yeah. up to try to get out of the ground pound traps. Very smart idea. Nice flip combo into plus frames again. 2-4-2. Two, two, good block. Definitely going to get a setup now that we're in the corner. All right. Mix up City. He spaced him out. He wants him to jump. Nice back one string. Breaker. EX, well, not enough for the kill. Nice teleport. Actually, he can come back from this. He's gonna get another setup and then he's gonna push her out full screen again, is my guess. And nice, nice flip wake kick. Up. Finally, James takes a round. Oh, sorry, a game. Mm -hmm. And Oil King, has, Oil King has stood up. He's out. Out cold. Oh, d he's out as in he left. I thought you. <laughs> Where did he go? I don't know. I think he realized he was on stream. <laughs> that was hilarious. That happened so quick. One yeah. minute he was asleep, the next game he was gone. Oh, he, he I, was, he was just, no, he, I don't think his pool's over yet, so he was oh, okay. catching a quick rest. But anyway... migo san has got yeah. a pretty big lead in this round. He's Two been doing a better straight. job of keeping James out. Oh, nice. nice. Armor. EX armor. That move gets so much health back, it's actually sick. Very useful. One more. Nice flip again. Wow, still confirmed. Well done. Down four. Free pressure. Nice confirm again. Oh, did not get the oh, end of that combo. Armor again. That, that armor has been saving it's been, it's been saving him, okay? But actually, if Promo Kid blocks just once, point blank in that situation, yeah. it will completely, completely change how these rounds have been ending. I wonder if he's aware of that yet. I, know, I think he wants to go for the mix-up. He yeah. wants to end it quickly. I know, but blocking is a mix-up. 
Yeah, that's true. I'm wondering if, it, if it's the fact that he knows this is the guy who taught him Mortal Kombat. If he, if he doesn't want to risk block, if he just wants to end it quickly. Nice grab. But he's being ended now. Yeah, it's going to be hard for him to get out of this corner. Nice oh. armor. So smart. Low. And, oh, and that is that's it. it. All right, so Amigo san will advance to the grand final, but our combo king showing some promise with Cassie Cage. He will have another chance uh, later yeah. on in the losers final. Next up, we have semis. Woo, let's go. Pinoy versus Reddick. All right. This will be a two out of three set because it's still a loser's semifinal, not the loser's final. Pinoy just is yet. a new, newer player. I haven't, I haven't seen much of him. I actually haven't seen him in tournaments. Well, I haven't been to the last few tournaments. Reddick is an old school MK player. He also plays Street Fighter, right? Yeah. He Street Fighter at this event. He kind of dropped out a lot, uh, from tournaments a couple, a few months back, but he's been joining again. Because there's been research as as of late. Because after last year, after Manila Cup last year, he kind of went down. Because Migo and his brother Martin were, were winning everything. Then this year, a new bunch of players from up north just showed up and showed they were good. So it's it's re revived the community. That injustice too hype. That's what it is. People know the new game's coming.